While searching for the witch Siri had quarreled with, Geralt ran into an old friend, Kira Metz. Sorceress told the Witcher about a masked mage. Siri had seemed to taken shelter in his hideout. The Witcher set off to find it, with Kira in tow. Siri had never reached the Elven Mage, yet the Wild Hunt had. The ghostly retinue was one step ahead of Geralt, or so it seemed. The Witcher felt that all was lost, until Kira gave him a new lead. The Crones of Crookback Bog. I want to talk. You death, damn it! I told you! Open the door! Who are you? I'm a Witcher. What of it? Why should I care? I've been to the island. I know what happened there. Your lover sent me here. Open the door. What do you want of me? Graham. Graham, Graham, Graham. Want to talk to you about Annabelle. Annabelle? What can you know about her? Everything that her. she told me. Talk to her. Annabelle's dead. Drank poison. And I... I couldn't save her. Did you love her? I... Something mad. Loved her so deep I believed we'd come through. Believed we'd be together. You hear that, Annabelle? Which was not to her father's liking. His daughter and a plain lout. You hear that, Annabelle? He loves you. He still does. Look at the way he's talking about you. Look at the amount of regret and remorse you can see in his eyes. He still cares about you, and I hope you know that. What happened on Fike Isle? You gotta tell me. It's where Millie, Finch, and Faulkner, they rallied the men, all roughs, to go to the Isle, take back what was ours from the noble. They knew I was known at the tower, that the Lord's servants would open the gate for me as soon as I sold them fish. They forced you to go with them? No, I... I saw my chance in it. For Annabelle and me to flee. But... It all spun in a chaos. Our boys from the village, they started killing everyone. Annabelle, they wanted to rape! Disgusting. <gasps> then she drank the poison. He has her picture Major still. Gave her. I ran out the tower hollering that I wanted to die, cursing them all to hell. Don't force me to speak of it. No more, please. He even has a dedicated shrine to her. Oh, this man is so severely heartbroken. I feel so sorry for him. Said you were hollering as you fled the tower, the island. What exactly did you say? I don't remember. I wanted them to pay for what they'd done to her. Might have cursed them. There's a powerful magic aura on Fike Isle. Passions, evil intent, strong emotions of any kind can activate it. Your words could be the curse's source. She took the poison because of them. It wasn't poison. Annabelle drank a strong sleeping potion. Mage wanted to protect her, make it look like she was dead. Convinced everyone. But that means... Is she... She's not. You said you spoke to her. Spoke I spoke to, to her, her spirit. By the time she awoke, Tower was full of cold corpses. And rats. She was warm meat. Rats ate her alive. She was alive the whole time. But... Can't be. She was cold all through like a corpse. I shook her, begged to open your eyes. I never thought. It's not you your know. fault. No guilt in not knowing, and you couldn't know it wasn't poison she drank. So God, don't blame yourself. If I had stayed behind to bury her, I didn't notice she was alive. It might have ended different, ended well. If you'd stayed on the island, I doubt you'd have survived. I take death over leaving her to the rats like that. But there's naught I can do about it now. Wrong on that count. That's why we're here. Because you can definitely still help her. Annabelle needs you. Her soul will only find peace if you help her. But what can I do? It's too late. Bury her bones. 
Annabelle should be laid to rest by one who loved her. It's the only way to lift the curse that holds Fike Isle. There's a... her bones. Yes. yes. Give them here. And leave me be. I am so sorry for your loss, Graham. I really am. But at least we both are able to see that Annabel is finally going to be able to rest. And that's good enough for me. What is that? What the hell happened? Bro, I thought you said you were going to bury her bones. Like dead. Woo! Okay. Okay. Ooh. 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 Okay. Okay. Select. And now she's free. Oh, wow. He died. Oh, this is bad. Damn, I'm sorry, Graham. If I knew giving you her bones would result in you being dead, I would have never done it. But then again, Graham did say that he would rather die. So, there you go. Look at this, though. Look at that shrine. The letters, the flowers, the candles for drawing. You can tell he really loved her. And you know what? Even though it's sad that you also died, at least you two are able to be together. And look at the amount of rats. Like, this is disgusting. This is horrible. I'm, I'm out. I'm out. Lover of ladies here, like my video, share my video, leave your comments below because I just love talking to you guys. But most importantly, please subscribe to the channel. That way you'll be able to get daily gaming content from me. And hit that notification button as well so you know when I upload my videos. You can also catch me on Twitch at loverofladies 69 Geralt, just when I was starting to miss you. Miss me? Wow. That is so funny that you mentioned that. If you really missed me that much, you would have came with me to the island, but whatever. Fike Isle's free of its curse. And you withheld this news until now? Why? What do you mean? I gave you a Xenovox. But the curse, what was its source? The dark spell clung to the spirit of Annabelle, the Lord's daughter. To free her and the Isle, Graham, her beloved, had to help me. So it ended well. Mm. I lifted the curse so the island's clear. Annabelle's soul is free. Thing is, turned out she's a pesta. Graham's dead. And you fail to notice. You're losing your touch. Be that as it may, Fike Isle is free of its curse. That's important. I'm almost inclined to say good work. One thing's bothering me. What? Annabelle said Alexander was studying diseases. She mentioned Catriona. You know anything about that? All the mages knew about it. Alexander was a highly regarded epidemiologist. I would have given anything for an opportunity to study his notes, but he guarded them jealously. Sounds like he doesn't want anyone else to know what he found. The lamp. What do you want to do with it? As I said, you may keep it. I don't believe I shall need it anymore, given the eye's been cleansed. I actually All regret right. not going there with you. Oh, now you Perhaps do. Perhaps we can make up for that lost time now. Okay, well, in that case, bye. All right. Time I was on my way. Perhaps... Perhaps you'd stay just a bit longer? There's one small favor you might yet do for me. What, what is, is it? it? I put in an order for a few substances from Novigrad. The trader was due to be here yesterday, but has yet to arrive. Could you see what happened? The package is rather important to me. Why not? If he was coming here from Novigrad, he must have passed through Blackbow. I'll check the area. Thank you. I shall be ever so grateful. Anytime, Kira. Anytime. What now? What is going on? Ask a service of the Witcher, the Pelham. Oh. A witcherly service, that's to say. Hey, what friend. Do you need? Tell me. A man who fears no evil, the Pelham needs. 
forefather's eve is nigh. We've rites to conduct. Wandering souls to emerge, damned souls too. We've the circle to protect from these wretches. Wait, what? What are you talking about? Why hold the ritual at all? At times men die choking with regret. At times death takes them before they've tasted any bitterness in life. These poor souls, unfulfilled, cannot leave this veil of tears. Their spirits wander midst the living, must be judged, sent on their way. This we do on Forefather's Eve. Forefather's Eve. That sounds like a very interesting ritual, holiday. I'm not sure, but. What'll I get out of it? Witches do naught for free. This the Pella knows. Not to fear. How to reward one for their aid. This too the Pella knows. It seems like this. I mean, I've helped him before. Especially with finding princes, so I'm used to the way he talks. But it's so funny how he talks in a form of poetic syntaxes. Even though Loki just gets straight to the point. But at the same time, it's The Witcher 3, so what do you expect? Seems like you could use a Witcher, so yeah, I'll help. You'd not refuse the Pell on you. The time's come to gather the folk. Across the lake we must journey to fight Isle. Wait, what? In the circle of stones we shall meet. Wait, the what? The sooner we resolve this, the better. Best do it tonight at midnight. I was just there. I was just there. This is crazy. Greetings. Let's go. Just Let's get to time. it. Of course. I was meditating right Good next folk. to you. Behold the one who will protect us. You needn't fear. How bad is this going to be, priest? Soon shall we summon the wandering souls. Beyond all help, some will be. From these, you must protect us. Evil Ooh. creatures keep at bay. Keep at bay till the ritual's done. Begin. Keep us from harm, and let them not disturb the circle. You know what? I'm right here. Let's go. What's going to come? What is this life? Well, you know. What comes next once life subsides? Soon will rise thy dead, thy buried. Just in case, you never know. Will ye grant these souls reprieve? Let's begin for Father's Eve. My thing is, where are they gonna attack? Oh, then? Okay, say less. Say less. Come here. Ew, what? What? Come on. Come on. Stupid water hag. There you go. Next. You too. Thank you. Next. Who else? Next. I got rid of all the downers. Hark, a sound I hear. Tis right. A spirit breaks the still of night. Burn the incense ever higher. Spirit, join us round the fire. Spirit, speak. This time is yours. Tell us of your ghostly woes. Whoa. Who are you? He knows. Oh, and he speaks. Priest, who is he? Should I drive him away? No. <laughs> okay. I'll let you take it from here I've then. I've come for you, Patricide. Be gone, foul force. I cast upon you the light of the eternal fire. Abomination. Stop this at once. Do I need to silence. fight you too? We must help them. Silence. I'll not tolerate necromancy. Help me. I gotta uh, fight them too? 
Leave now. You're disrupting the ritual. This is black magic. These folk disturb the dead. We cannot allow it. We will not. You don't know a thing about their customs. Take it and disperse the others. So I gotta cut them up, huh? Say less. Leave not these grounds. Come on! Come on! Sorry, my man, but he asked for help, so I gotta help him. Leave him alone. Next. Tis an evil turn. Evil. Woe away. Blood has stained the hallowed ground. What do you want me to do? They were trying to attack us. The bloodshed. It do any harm? Tainted lies the circle now. They who thirst for the gore of men shall come. God's willing, they will be few, and the Pella shall finish the right. If you want to continue, I'm ready. I'm trusting Good you. Folk, we must the eve complete. Prepare yourselves. Ye we summon, ye we call. Enter souls, we'll judge ye all. All is Something whispers, something peeps. Someone near our fire creeps. What? This sacred ground is with blood stained. We cannot the ritual complete. People, save yourself. If your lives you value, run. Whoa, there's three of them. Ooh, awkward. Okay. Come on. Girl. Okay, let's go. Come on. Woo! This is bad. Come on. Thank you. Got you. Alright, I got rid of all of them. Great, a bloodshed during a ritual is never good. Alas, I'm sorry. All is lost. Hmm, gotta be a peasant who told the witch hunters about the ritual. That One of your people away. is a your traitor. Father's ghost, right? Threatened to come back, likely to keep his word. Old man Ambros, the pillar fears not. That wraith called you a patricide. He get it right? Aye. If I'm gonna help you, I gotta know everything. Why'd you kill your father? The Pella does not wish to speak of this. First of all, fine, you don't have to tell me everything, but how can I help you if I don't know what's really going on? You can't hope to manage this alone. You're afraid, that's clear. Wraith will hold sway over you. Listen, I'll send him off. I've got to. But I need to know where he's buried. The corpse probably hasn't turned to dust yet. That's his bond to the world of the living. Ambros lies in the swamp. Fine. Really? I'll That's why he's body. here? See what I can do. So this is where I might find the four the Peller's father's body. And knowing that he's freshly dead, mm, these drowners are just trying to find some good bodies to eat. But you know what? Time for me to slay them! Who wants to die? You do, right? Say less. Say less. Damn. Come on. Ooh. Come on. Woo! Nasty little critters. Crazy how just stabbing them enough they explode. Okay, so if I was a dead body, where would I be? The swamps kept Ambrose's body in good shape. What? Right here? Even where the Peller smashed his head in, got wow. incinerated. That ought to get the Spectre to leave. Okay, time for me to burn the body. Leave the world of the living. Never return again. That's it. 
That's all I had to do. Crazy. White wolf. Wise wolf. What is it the wolf needs? So... I saw your father's body, and I noticed that his skull had a smashed indent. You still don't want to tell me what happened? Found your father's body. Had to burn it. Good you did. Return for me, ye would have. What's your story? You actually kill your father? It was an evil man. The Pella feared him once, but then grew brave. Oh, wow. What his father did to his mother. The Pella could not look upon it. So he split the father's head with an axe. Left him in the swamp. But folk knew. So the dad was abusing the mom, and he's old enough to finally defend his, his mom. Okay. That makes sense. Ghost's not likely to come back. Thank you, Witcher. A reward for your aid. And if herbs or remedies you ever need, for near nothing you will have them from me. You know what? I can't even blame this man. If I had to endure my father abusing my mom and hurting her in any way, shape, or form, I too would have done something. So Kira asked me to double check to see what happened with her package. But I'm starting to think maybe the package was lost in transit. Either... Ew! I'm sorry, those drowners, when they make those noises, they're so weird. But yeah, I'm thinking maybe it was lost in transit because the package got... Ooh, what is this? Hold on, what's this? No, I don't want that. Just, just right here, right here. Wide, heavy wheels. Merchant's wagon. So, the wide, heavy wheels went where? Here? Huh. So, it basically it got off the got road. The road. Well. But why? Was it attacked? Clearly, whoever was driving this was trying to run away from something. But what? What was it? I see the wheel. Was that part of the carriage? And also, if that's the case, then where did the rest of the carriage land? Because at this point, I just don't really see anything here. I mean, I see the lines. Yeah, oh, no. That way that was gonna end well. Oh, that merchant's long dead. I can tell. Leftovers, cuts of meat, cataplepis. Wonder what spell requires that. Kira, are you up to your sneaky ways? Still intact. Don't sense anything magic though. Wonder how Kira will explain this one. Human, from an artery. Can't be far. Wouldn't have made it. Wow, that's crazy. The merchant died. Huh. Interesting. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna talk to Kira, see what's up, because this he this thing here, suspicious. Just when I was starting to miss you. Really? How cute. Got those uh, substances you wanted? Splendid. I can finally begin my study of double arboreal racination patterns. But the what? Of... Brew yourself a mug of mulled wine. Saw what the wagon was carrying. Exquisite meats, expensive wines, Zeracanian spices. Not a speck of magic. What Can gives, Kira? What up to? I would rather show you. But he must wait a bit. Really? Okay. Color me intrigued. Fine, I'll wait. <laughs> then shoo outside. Gonna slip into something more comfortable. Later. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. Well, go on, out. Been patient, thank you. It's almost ready. Rat? But white uh, ones. If I wanted to see white mice, I'd just get drunk. Note that I said almost. Now don't interrupt. Wow, horses? Just like in Cinderella. Third mouse. What happened to it? 
The spell has a 66.67% chance of success. I always use one more than I need, just in case. Very analytical. Here, can I explain what's going on here? Know the fairy tale about Cinderella? Mm -hmm. Yeah. True story it's based on, too. A zoogle cropped up in a palace pond and ate Princess Cinderella whole. Left behind one slipper, so... That's not how I remembered it, but... Now to return to the fairy tale. I'd like to escape these ghastly swamps for one magical night. I don't need a fairy godmother. I'll cast the spells myself. But I could use a Prince Charming. It just so happens you're the only decent candidate in all Velen. Okay. So, what do you say to a moonlight ride on horseback? And dinner? I'm a witcher, not a gigolo. <laughs> don't flatter yourself. I don't want to shag you in the bushes, but to share a pleasant evening. Okay, good. As That's long evening. as... Then no. You know... You know what? As long as you said it's a pleasant evening, then fine, I'll do it. Oh, all right. I'll do it. I feel honored. Truly. Before okay. Before we go, there's one more thing. What? Gotta transform a pumpkin into a carriage? No. I shall transform our rancid rags into something more glamorous. Don't wince. It'll only be an illusion, won't hurt a bit. And at dawn, everything will return to normal. Why not? Might as well go all out. Alright, give me tight. some out. Give me something Bad good to land. see and wear. Wow, Kira. So, what do you think? Neckline too modest? It's just right. Oh, I might also have changed your hair color while I was at it. I've always fancied dark haired men. Cut it out, Kira. Oh, well, any port in a storm. Well, off we go. Dinner's waiting. Okay, cool. Last one there does the dishes. Oh, no. Move it. Come on. I'm not trying to do no dishes. Okay? I have did a lot of your dirty work. So it's time for you to do your end, okay? And besides, I like doing these little horse races. Especially since I always get to win, so... And Kira, you're so far behind, dear. Come on, catch up. Don't you like a little friendly competition, Kira? Come on, keep up, or should I let you win? Oh, my stamina! No! Oh, my stamina! No! Hell no, Kira! Get out! I'm gonna make sure you're behind. I'm not gonna let you win. No! Come on. No, for real. I, I'm very competitive. Kira, you're not gonna win. So, where is this place? Why is it taking so long? Okay, let me gallop. Nope, sorry, Kira. I'm not gonna let you cut me off. Yep, that's right. I'm salty, I don't care. Oh, right here? Okay. Bread? Grapes? Hell yeah, I'm all for it. I like this. This is nice. <laughs> Congratulations. You'd make an excellent jockey. I just don't want to lose. Only are a foot shorter and five stone lighter. Well, yes. But then I'd not have invited you here. Now do you see why I needed those substances? Yes, a nice little dinner. Could have just told me what this was about, Rhino. <laughs> Geralt, run to the woods and fetch my shopping. I'd like to make dinner. Well, would you have helped? Yeah, if you're gonna feed if me. If I'd known I'd get a glass of Zubaran dry in return, of course. Well, well, never took you for a wine connoisseur. Think Are you impressed? Think we the marrow out of drowner bones and wash it down with puddle water? More or less. <laughs> Well, we've chatted long enough on empty stomachs. Let's dig in. Hell it's yeah. A small fortune. Sure you don't need me to pitch in? Please, I manage. You know, a dozen eggs here, a cockoganda there. Besides, my finances are about to improve. All right, cheers to that. How, if you don't mind my asking? I mean, you'd think the only work to be had in Velen would be in farming. Yeah, that's a good point. <laughs> Very true. How? So, I have two options. I can either start cultivating turnips or leave. So you are leaving. But that's not what I wish to discuss. Thank you once again, Geralt, for your help with the tower. You were fabulous. Not the first curse I've lifted. But among the most difficult, correct? What happened on that island? 
Why I shiver at the thought. And the laboratory. I sincerely hope you burnt everything. The cages, the corpses, the papers. I didn't. Didn't destroy that workshop if that's what you're asking. Didn't see any reason to. If Alexander's findings were to fall into the wrong hands. Although, Fike Isle has a terrible reputation. None even dare go there. Perhaps there's nothing to worry about. <laughs> I'm sorry. Such a gloomy subject to broach. I simply shouldn't have, not during our romantic dinner. Right. Romantic what? I thought we came here as friends. Yeah, friends. Kira. With benefits. Oh, <gasps> Kira! Kira? So you lured me here in the false pretenses that this was going to be a friendly dinner? When Loki, you want my witcher penis? Sorry, there's someone else. <laughs> so what? So what? I'm a Geralt, faithful man. Geralt. You're so old fashioned. So what? Who cares? Respect my choice. Will you at least lie down and gaze at the stars with me? Platonically? Why not? Platonically. So no touching. Thank you. No touching. No, no hand holding. Nothing. Mm. Dragon something, I bet. <laughs> no. It has a different name. A bit indecent, actually. Lean closer and I'll whisper it in your ear. Don't be trying to kiss me Ed now. Oh, wow. I mean, at least she did Kill. have the respect Where? to not take advantage of me. But she did put I'm me to sleep. sleep with a spell. Means she's up to something. Well, brat. <sighs> Fike Isle, the tower. She's going to try and burn everything. And guess what? Knowing Kira's luck, she's going to go and ask for help. So I might as well just follow her to the town. Thank you for watching. This is Lover of Ladies, and I'll see you next week.